Hi there, this is Carl from GTD and this is an unboxing of the Mad Cat's Mouse 9. Uh, the Mad Cat's Mouse 9 was created because the Rat 9, which is Mad Cat's professional gaming mouse, was being used by a lot of consumers who didn't really need all of its gaming features but wanted a mouse that was quite nice to hold and good to use. Um, so let's have a look inside it. Uh, for the first part we've got just a box here which has a carry case. Uh, so if you want to take it out with you, you know, to the zoo or to the park or even maybe to a gaming tournament, you won't get it scratched. Uh, also inside the box are, as you'd expect, the instruction manuals and by the looks of things, some stickers. Because who doesn't love stickers? And finally, according to this box, there is a battery. Let's have a look at the mouse. <coughs> okay, uh, I'm going to need a screwdriver for this. So the Mouse 9 is quite light, uh, it's definitely lighter than the Rat 9, which a lot of people didn't like the weight of. Um, it's got quite a solid feel when you hold it in your hand, but it's deemed a little bit plasticky, but I suppose that's the gloss finish. Uh, it also comes with a red gloss finish or a white gloss finish, or you can get the black version but with matte. Um, there has 10 buttons on here, which are all programmable through the drop and drag into drag and drop interface, which uh, Mad Cats provide. Um, there are some quite interesting ones, like this one here can activate the instant viewer, they're calling it, uh, which lets you see all the windows that are open on your Windows computer, or if you've got a Mac it'll activate Expose. Uh, this button here will activate the zoom function, which basically turns your mouse into a magnifying glass, which I guess could be quite useful. Uh, to connect to your computer it uses Bluetooth 4.0. Now that's quite useful because it means that you have much, much better battery life. In fact, Mad Cats think that the mouse should get up to a year uh, if you're just on a normal AA battery, but obviously no one's tested that. Unfortunately, a lot of computers don't have Bluetooth 4.0 at the moment, so if you don't, then there is a little USB receiver here, which will just plug into your computer and it'll work as you'd expect a mouse to work. It also has an adjustable palm rest, just like on the Rat 9, uh, so if you have big hands then it can be much more comfortable for you, or if you have small hands then it can be comfortable for you too, I suppose it's not excluding anyone. Uh, and that's the basic overview of the mouse, uh, we'll be doing a much more comprehensive review soon, so watch out for that.